Woohoo! Yay! We're recording. Um, so we're now at the top of the Decide Hour on Monday, February 7th, kickstarting our Monday. And we had done some brainstorming at um, the beginning of this hour um, with Jay and JL was on the call. She was sharing something special she did for herself over the weekend. Took some alone time, really. Um, and uh, really encouraged herself to try new things, to handle, approach life in a new way um, with a different form of energy than she might normally bring when she's out and about. Um, so it was really fun to hear that and um, challenge yourself to do some things like color her nails pink because pink is not her favorite color. And so she wants to like a challenge to get outside of her comfort zone. So I thought that was a really clever thing, which then gave Regina this. Regina, do you want to say what happened so we can record it? Sure. Yeah. Well, I've been having it floating around in the back of my mind that I would like to take um, a couple of days to just kind of do some unwinding and some uh, specific just kind of work stuff if I can but maybe even not I don't I don't know but wanting to do something and um I my go-to is usually to call my bestie and ask her and then we coordinate and we go wherever the two of us want to go I mean we coordinate so it's it's great it's a yin and a yang but it really however in the back of my mind when I've been thinking about it for the past couple of weeks it's kind of like there was just this nigging going on that I think maybe I need want to be alone, not need, but want to be alone. So it prompted me to start doing a little bit of research with my bonus time and um, start looking into it. And, and I'm going to make, I'm going to make a decision. I'm going to um, book something. And then by the end of the week, how's that? Oh, oh. Boy, I love this. Okay, so that's got to go into the community when you make it. With, I mean, you know, <laughs> in Facebook where you decide to go. I love it. So that inspired you. Oh, it's Inspire Month. And it, so oh, yay. JL's um, conversation inspired Regina to make a decision on uh, re-energizing, refreshing, and having some alone time. Woohoo! Awesome. So the conversation we started this morning, Nicole, was all about um, when was the last time you did something just for yourself, that self-care item, and what was it, and did it bring any newness to, um, you know, to the surface for you or any um, anything that you were kind of grappling with or, or challenged with, maybe. So it might be an opportunity or a challenge that comes from your alone time. So... Um, do you have a, a story to share about any t um, a time you've done some self-care and how that's um, supported you? Yeah, like I can't believe like this is just like a theme apparently because last week, so on last Monday, I woke up with the flu and I had it for the next couple of days and then like I pushed through it, whatever. And then I guess... This is where I, I more celebrated myself, but also I guess it falls in the same category as self-care. So, um, so yeah, pushed through the flu, got over that about Wednesday and then Thursday and Friday, like I took those two days just seriously for me. And on one of those days, I can't even remember what day it was. Like the, the days just flowed together. Like they were so easy and just flowy and just all of the things. And on one of them, like I went to go see my boyfriend in the morning and then the rest of the day, like I literally took for myself, like I went shopping, took myself out to eat, like all of the things. And I have never took myself out to eat, like sit down in a restaurant by myself kind of thing. And it was the most like, I don't even know what the word is, but it was the most epic experience and I totally am down to do it again like oh it was so good oh my gosh I love that just hearing your energy around this and like the space that opened up for you 
Yeah. Oh my gosh, so amazing. Um, yeah, and um, I, I, oh, wow, wow, the flowy part really sit with me too. So now, so far, Susie, if you watch the recording on this, we've hit um, JL's conversation from earlier at this hour, inspired, it's Inspire Month, Regina, to do some research and decide by the end of the week something she's going to do for self-care. <laughs> so we are just flowing on the on purpose, uh, everything that happens on purpose. And then Nicole brings up, I had an easy flowy weekend. And I'm like, well, flow is my word for the year. So bring it on, girlfriend. Bring on. Yep. OP. <laughs> love it. Love it. <laughs> And oh my gosh, so Susie and Angela, welcome. Um, Susie, how was your last hour? It was so good. This waking up early thing is kind of fun. I just told my dad that I was like, I made, so Brian hasn't been feeling good all weekend. And so I made him breakfast in bed and I even gave like a banana and he didn't ask for it. And I made myself some avocado toast and eggs and like, it's fun. Like I'm having fun. <laughs> what a way to kickstart your Monday. Uh, and how, about, how was your last hour? I'm back. Good to see you. You're talking to me? Yeah. How was your last hour? I just got here. I'm here for the nine o'clock hour. Yeah, I know. We're just we're I just you see it. I'm confused. Okay. Okay, but that's okay. Yeah. My so, last hour was fine. I woke up and yeah, hi. <laughs> Yay. Awesome. Okay. Well, that wraps up the eight o'clock decide hour. I should stop the recording. And um, then I am going.